Hi guys, Helen's Armour here, and today we are looking at the Super Smash, but first, as usual, the YouTube things. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you think that if you like this video or any of my content, hit that like button. It uh, helps out the algorithm a little bit. Of course, any questions, I am love. I am happy to take in the uh, comment section. If you want to support the channel, there is merch, and there's a Patreon in the description below. So, let's talk about this blaster. Well, I already have a Super Spamf, and that's that. In fact, my Spamf is sitting right there, so why do I have another one? Well, it was a commission for my wonderful patron, Arison. So if you want to join the ranks of my wonderful patrons, go ahead and hit that link in the description and join. There's some cool perks in there that I'm hoping to do more with this summer. We shall see. So let's talk about this spamf and talk about the lore behind it. So Arison sent me some lore along with this commission on where this blaster comes from. And it's that he contacted a alien race uh, interested in some of their weaponry and said, yeah, I, I know y'all like all the flashy colors, but can we tone it down a little bit for my commission? And they said, oh yeah, sure, we got you, and sent him this. Which is not toned down and not very colorful by our standards, which just shows, to, which just goes to show you, check the standards of the people you're talking to, because sometimes you get colorful things and you're not expecting them. Uh, and to that end, I tried to stay uh, true to the reference photos he sent me, and I am very happy with the way this came out. Um, he did want it a little beat up and a little worn, so I put a couple uh, different color washes over this, and a good bit of dry brushing over it just to get it a nice, loved, worn look. Um, now a note to Arison, if you, if you uh, think the dry brushing is a little too much, you can of course take a wet cloth to it, it is all... Uh, water soluble paint and it is under the clear coat uh, it's just something I like to do on my paint job so that I can adjust the weathering so as it gets more naturally dirty I can peel off a little bit of the paint dirty and make it look a little more natural but that being said I'm really pleased with the way this paint job came out um, I did not print these parts these parts were sent to me by Arison as long as well with the base blaster and the hardware uh, and I wanted to add some purple, especially up in this body section here. And so I had to color match the purple he sent me and I found this Jean Steeler purple by Citadel Paints to be just a wonderful color match. Um, and I'm very happy with the way this paint job came out. I had a lot of fun doing it and it being a super spam. It works great. It has the stock Falcon Fire Spring in here with the spring spacer that's just in the spam file kit. Um, can't remember. I might have put a wrap of uh, E-tape or two around the plunger just to increase the seal a little bit, but not too much. It's getting about 100 FPS on average, uh, which is plenty for HVZs and most wars and especially for the LARPs like uh, Nuke Lanta, which Arison writes a story for. If you haven't seen my video about that awesome weekend, I went down and, uh, well, went crazy in the wasteland. Put a link and uh, enjoy it. Um, that being said, uh, I've got to go ship this out to Arison because he is taking it to com a convention in a week and I really wanted to get it to him. I'm very happy with this way this came out. and. Uh, as I wrap up this video, let me just say, yes, I do take commissions. I have always taken commissions. I just haven't talked about it. Um, there is an email in the description of all my videos where you can contact me about commissions. That being said, if you want to uh, support the channel in a uh, in any way, uh, hit the subscribe button. Patreon, uh, Teespring links are in the description as well as that email for commissions. Um, if you do commission me for something, I will make a little look at video like this on my uh, channel here just to show it off and show you all what I'm building. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next time.